We are building up to the big game in the IPL. It's between two teams that are in the top bracket of the IPL points table. Chennai versus Mumbai. This game will be played at the Chepok Stadium. Now, I say it is also a big game because you've also got two big stars in MS Dhoni versus Rohit Sharma. I'm Nikhil Naz and with me, Ajit Agarkar and Sean Tate will begin by taking a look at how the two teams have performed over the years. These are the head-to-head -head meetings. Overall, 25 times they've played and Mumbai hold the edge. In fact, since 2018, if you take a look at it, uh, it's Mumbai that has won twice and once for Chennai at Chepok as well. Now, home advantage mostly, Chennai do really good with that. Here too, Mumbai hold the edge. Uh, Sean, I don't think there'll be too many teams across the IPL that would have had a better record head to head than Chennai versus Mumbai. Yeah, Mumbai. thinking the same thing. That must yeah. be the only team. Yeah. That, yeah. And then it probably goes to show they've won a few championships mm. too, haven't they? A couple, mm. three, is it? Two, three. Mm. Three, I think. Three. They've won three now. I think. So, yeah. Three, so, isn't it? Yes, yeah. three. So it just goes. Three, three, three each, two yeah. more successful teams in the IPL. Well, I mean, uh, they are definitely the bogey team. What is it that makes it uh, a bogey team for Chennai? So Chennai seem to have found solution for every team, but the Rohit Sharma led Mumbai. Yeah, I mean, it's not it's not a too it's not a very bad record that Chennai mm. have. Of mm. course, Mumbai hold uh, edge slightly. Mm. Mumbai is a formidable team. I think mm. one of the things that Mumbai does well is play spin well, uh, which negates uh, Chennai's threat yeah. a bit, uh, mm. especially when they play at Chepok. When they come to Mumbai, that threat is anyway not there. The spin threat because the pitch is such a good one. Uh, and Mumbai have a bit of pace in their mm. attack, uh, which works especially when they play at Mumbai. So, mm. uh, just good, two good teams. Uh, yeah. and Mumbai have most bases covered, whether it's mm. Indian players who are batters or hitters, uh, or some bowling with Bumrah and the like. So, yeah. uh, just a good team, which uh, obviously Chennai haven't found too many uh, answers for. They did uh, last time when Bravo played that uh, blinder luck, yeah. in the first game. But uh, someone individual has to have won games for Chennai. Mm -hmm. I think Mumbai have M Mumbai I think have the goods to counter what Chennai's uh, best team is. Okay, we'll ask your predictions also a little later. For the moment, we'll take a look at the playing 11s. Any changes there for the playing 11? We'll start with Chennai Super Kings and Sean Tate has picked his playing 11. Let's see if it's got any changes. As I can see at the moment, no, you're happy with the 11 that played last time. Also won the game for you. Oh, so. look, you could sit there again and, and maybe pick a couple out. But look, I just think, that, and the way the journey probably goes about things, unless there's mm -hmm. tactical change or if there's a reason behind it, a niggle or something, I don't mm -hmm. think... After after playing the way they're playing and, and getting a win and, and all that, I think they should just keep the same side. Um, and it's also worked for them. They have yeah. persisted with Watson. Yeah, He's for them. Is, yeah, yeah, exactly. And, and, and Harbhajan playing against mm -hmm. Mumbai mm -hmm. as well. Mm -hmm. It's going to be um, yeah, keep him in the side, I think, as well. Mm -hmm. um, get big scalps. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, guys like Watson have stood up. So I think their, their team's going pretty well. All right, let's take a look at the Mumbai playing 11. Any changes there? We've got Ajit to pick the likely playing 11 for Mumbai Indians. And uh, no changes for you as well. You've still gone with three spinners because it's going to be played at Chepok. Yeah, yeah. two. I mean, ideally, uh, the two leg spinners. I mean, Kronal, Kronal yeah. every now and then bowls. But uh, uh, yeah, Markand has got a good re record, I think, against Chennai. Or not record, but at least has had a good game. I think he's got MS yeah. uh, Dhoni out. At the moment, you need a bowler who can get Dhoni out. I think he's sort of carrying... Uh, yeah. Chennai is batting a little bit. So, mm. yeah, you could always get Ishan Kishan in for one of the spinners mm. uh, and then yeah, get Berendorf for Ben Cutting uh, if you need to increase yeah. a bit more front line seam bowling. Um, but you do need spin in Chennai. We've seen that before. You can control the game in the middle mm. if you have decent spinners and both leg spinners. Mm. We've seen these days that uh, a lot of batsmen struggle against leg spin. Yeah. Uh, for that, they'll have to get Watson out. Mm. Okay, <laughs> talking about the key issues that both teams need to address, we'll start with uh, Chennai Super Kings. Sean, we'll give you that responsibility. Uh, one <laughs> <Thanks>. thing that <laughs> one thing that you've noticed, yes, they won the last game, but still uh, yeah. that that middle order really not firing. Yeah, for them. I look at a couple of names for that middle order, I suppose, and, and they got to step up. But we said, you know, the week, uh, the, what was one of the weak things was, you know, guys like Watson haven't stepped up, mm. but Chennai is that sort of franchise, and he does step up all of a sudden. Mm. Um, gets a big score, and now he's probably going to go on. You'd think the sort of player he's to go and have a big tournament now. So they've covered that base, but yeah, I think the middle order. Um, yeah, Suresh Rainer as well has been a bit, yeah, a bit off. Yeah, cold, yeah, yeah, he's a bit hot and cold as well. So a player like him gets going. Um, look, at the end of the day, th their biggest issue is just this game itself. I look at that Mumbai team, mm. and 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 Ajit's right. They're, they're formidable. They they stack up very well. They spin down at um, Chennai. Um, their batsmen play the spin pretty well. Mm -hmm. There's some good fast bowlers. I think these two are the best 
Okay, Delhi's playing well um, at the moment, obviously, but these two are the best two sides. All right. For mm -hmm. Mumbai, not any major area of concern. The only thing I think they'd want to improve on, Rohit Sharma, is their start performer, not had the best of the IPL so far. Yeah, generally the top order batting, I think. Uh, you know, you want bulk of the runs being done by them. And you know, Hardik Pandya and Pollard and those guys, uh, Krunal, uh, lower down have been really good. But mm -hmm. you don't want to leave too much for them to do. So, mm -hmm. Rohit, Surya Kumar... Yeah, the, the cock the they need cock, to yeah. take, uh, you know, or need to have some big innings now because mm -hmm. coming to the business end of the tournament, you would think that Mumbai should qualify mm -hmm. comfortably. They'd ideally want to be in the top two. Mm -hmm. And if they have that uh, top order sorted, uh, they'll be in good shape. All right, funny I talk about the problems of Mumbai Indians and I mentioned Rohit Sharma because our next bit is players to watch out for. Ajit Agarkar has picked Rohit Sharma. So you reckon now is the time that he's going to come again? Yeah, I mean, I, he's batted well at times. Uh, he Only hasn't quite gone on. Problem, yeah, he hasn't yeah. quite gone on for some reason. Mm. Uh, yeah, look, it, it, the stage is set, sort of thing. Uh, big games, Chennai. Uh, he'll have to counter spin. Uh, that's the other thing. I know he's. he's yeah. I think we we had a stat before where he's gotten out to spin quite a few times this yep. season. Yeah. Uh, so that this will be a big challenge, I think, mm. with against maybe Harbhajan. Uh, Ravindra Jadeja who takes the ball away, mm. those conditions suit him and maybe Imran Tahir later if yeah. he's uh, yeah. if he's around. But mm. okay, if he plays well, Mumbai Indians generally end up winning games. Uh, so I expect you, uh, Rohit to come good. Yeah, he's gotten out to leg spinners. Imran Tahir is there. Whether he'll be used in that power play, we'll have to wait and see because MS Dhoni hasn't used much of Imran Tahir there. But talking about playing against spin, this man does it rather well. Yes, the last knock came after a long time. Irrespective of that, uh, he plays spin rather well and you can see in those numbers as well. Yeah, I mean, he's obviously with him, you'd, you'd want to be, if you can swing the ball early mm -hmm. with the pace, um, that would be the, the ideal way to start to Shane Watson. But I, I've just picked him purely because he's now back in form. I mean, that innings he played was if he's never been out of form. Yeah. Um, mm. And then I just think against Mumbai, I think he's got a pretty good record against Mumbai in the past. He seems to step up against them uh, yeah. from memory, from mm. playing. Mm. That might have changed over the years, but certainly playing with him, I remember Mumbai, he'd, he'd tend to step up to that, to that occasion. Him and Pollard love the clash as well. Mm. So it's going to be good to watch. Yeah. Mm. All right, finally, prediction. Just pick the team. Ajit, you go first. Yeah, I think just Mumbai for me. I think okay. that just on paper, they are the better balanced team. I know the Chennai fans won't agree. Yeah. But, uh, yeah, in my opinion, that's just slight favourites. I think Chennai is play, probably playing better than Mumbai at this point. Yeah. Uh, but Mumbai for me. Okay. Yeah, I, this is the only team I would say in Chennai against Chennai are slight favourites. Yes, Mumbai. and the record suggests that. Two might be interesting for the points table as well. If Mumbai were to win, then you'd have a fight of who's going to finish in the top two. Because at the moment, Chennai seem like they've qualified, but the top two would be an interesting fight then. You're watching ESPN Quick Info Match Day. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe and leave your comments in the comment section below. Click on the bell icon for notifications.